Buddy, this thing is smashed everywhere. What the f What's going on guys? Nero over at Art Emotion. Today has finally come. We've been waiting for this time for a long, long time. We're gonna be shooting YouTube for you guys. Raw footage, raw vlogs, just a day-to-day -day life of, you know, just me in the shop, my employees, my family. Um, you guys are gonna see a lot of content. This first vlog has a lot of stuff as well. We've got some dope cars in here. And um, I hope you guys are gonna be enjoying this channel. Uh, this has been a dream of mine for a very, very long time. And my boy AM Films, he's gonna be doing all the content. So just stay tuned guys, um, tap in, subscribe. Let's get this going, baby. Yo, bro, you gotta get the other DJI, eh? You want me to get the DJI? I have it. I'll get the DJI. I have them. You wanna use mine? Sure. Bro, this thing kept falling last time. Come on, buddy. This thing has more dings on it from me alone. <laughs> You already know, this thing has been breaking the internet for the past week. Of course, you already know I had to protect it. That's the first thing we're gonna do before even driving the car. I did take it for a little teaser because obviously I did not get to drive the car. So I drove it for like a kilometer up the street and brought it right back. Uh, the rocks were pitching up everywhere. So we had to obviously protect it. We got Noah the goat right behind us. Mr. PPF Master, you've been seeing his cute face on, on the internet, breaking the reels. Uh, right now we're doing the passenger side fender and it is getting full body PPF, of course, we're not just doing the front end. We make sure we do full body PPF on all of our personal cars. We try to tell our clients with higher end cars, of course, it's worth it to do it. You don't ever wanna repaint a car that is at this caliber. Uh, and it could be the smallest little thing by just someone walking by with their bicycle or a cart that could nick it and scratch it. Uh, but yeah, take a look at what he's doing here. It doesn't feel real. Like last night I was laying down just on the floor. I kid you not, I was just sitting there and I'm like, this is crazy. Dude, like it's, it's just the beginning. I drove it yesterday, bro, literally just to the dealerships to go just talk to them. Yeah. And um, bro, the amount of head turn, okay. I never even got that with the Mac no, or like no. any other car. Like it's actually ridiculous. This is the car right now around the world, no it's, matter what. It's this is the crazy. Yeah, exactly. Like it's beyond crazy. It's 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 even at the dealer, like we would go, I went into, the new Benz, I went to the Audi, yeah. Volkswagen, all those dealers. Yeah. And every time I pulled up, bro, people were running out of the of dealership. I'm like, what? Like, it's overwhelming. Yeah. Okay. Purposely, I did silver because I hate black. Yeah, yeah. I just do not like black wheels because you don't see the beauty of them. And I didn't want to go gold, yeah. like that gold finish they had. Yeah. So I felt, I felt like it looked a, little, looked a little tacky, to be honest. But they put the sticker on top of the PPF, the factory PPF that's here. Of course, man. You got to figure this out. <laughs> Honestly though, when you think about it, because this, of well, being no, this, like a high impact top. area, yeah. You're on top of the full body, so you can always replace this. Yeah. Like I said, that one minute drive, bro, those rocks just like sitting mm -hmm. in the pot. Like you can still you see some in here. Like we try to get them out. This factory stuff is usually pretty thick. <clears throat> it is super thick. It's probably 10. It's, I think it's thicker than 10. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. So it almost feels like it's like 12 yeah, now. So, <laughs> 10. <laughs> So Gary, what, what exactly happened? They tried to steal it and they couldn't take it so they started smashing the whole car? Yeah. So this, I guess when they tried... Oh, all here. Yeah, look at this though. This is like real. So they started to like hit the car? Yeah, oh, f they like... Yeah, oh, oh, damn. Yo, the screen, look at this. <laughs> wow. Damn. Yeah, they smashed the windshield. They damaged it really bad. Wow, the back. That's from like rock or construction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like they, but they like, cause they couldn't take it. They started smashing the truck. Bro, they, they, they demolished the car. Like it's almost every single panel. I think this is the only one that's not damaged. I literally look at, I'm looking at every single panel has damage on it. Oh, way more than that. I was just showing them. I had a I had a claim for a car that got a small damage on another F one fifty, and it was seventeen k just for a rear bed, tail light, bumper, all that jazz. Thank you, my brother. See you in a bit. All right. Take care, bro. Yeah, man. So, sadly, uh, the thefts are just crazy in Toronto right now. It's the Greater Toronto area. Um, he was a victim of obviously this bull. Uh, they didn't only try to steal it, they end up vandalizing the whole entire car, smashing his screen, 
all the panels on the car, the glass, uh, just because they couldn't get it. And I think he was trying to chase them or something and then they got mad, so they started smashing the car. Uh, but it's nothing that we can't handle. We do insurance claims, as you can see, this cars are smashed here. We have theft recoveries. I have a Range Rover in the back that's a theft recovery. So we're gonna take care of it for him. We're gonna get him a rental and, and that's it. Like, this is what we do, guys. I mean, art in motion, come on. Oh, we're bringing in the Integra. There's no IAC in this thing, so you gotta keep it idling when it's cold. Uh, so we're gonna swap out those DC5 Recaros for the red Recaros that we just got picked up today. So stay tuned for that one, guys. Pop, uh, pop the hood, let's check the oil. Idling while it's cold, let's see. Yeah, it's good. Could probably use like a little bit. Go ahead. Yo, should check, check this out. Uh, we just got the renders for the Phantom that's outside. We're doing a 26 inch wheel, bringing, you know, obviously that old school to new school look. And of course we got the Art of Motion logo in there. So it's gonna be engraved. It's gonna be super, super dope. Just stay tuned. I'll show you this car outside. It's nuts. The car was in a collision. It was all gloss black before. We did it in this beautiful pearlescent uh, satin, white, blue, purple finish with the purple pinstripe. We took out the interior of the car, reupholstered it. It was like a tan brown, and now we did white and purple, and we're stopping the 26s to finish it off. Stay tuned for that, guys. Um, so we're just gonna be swapping over the rails from these DC5 uh, Type R Recaros. I sourced out the original Type R Recaros for, from a DC2 in red. They're like 9.9 .9 condition out of 10. Uh, obviously the car is red. All my interiors are red on all my cars, so I wanted to obviously put this one back. These are worth more, being the DC5 Recaros, uh, but I already have a buyer for these, so they're already sold. That's gonna look so much better now, guys. <laughs> uh, no, I asked him if the rail was the right side for the right seat, but this is the passenger side seat that we put the driver side rail on. <laughs> all right, whatever, fuck it. Let's take it off. Gotta do what you gotta do, man. It's all part of the life. I think the last time, yeah, the last time I actually worked on Hondas like this, like of my own cars and just building boys cars and not for business was 2011. 2011 Import Fest, Montreal. We won first place with my gray Integra. I still have that thing. Um, a lot of you have been asking to see it and like for me to finish it. We're like, why are you building all these other cars? But I promised myself that when I have kids one day that I would build it with them. Someone else calling. Um, and then I finally had kids. Yeah, yeah. Copyright stuff. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, so I promised myself that, you know, one day when I have kids, I'll finish building that car. Ended up obviously meeting someone, love of my life, and uh, got married. Now we have two boys, which is crazy. Um, and now I can actually one day finish that car with them. So I can easily finish it now. It's not about the money or anything like that. It's I promised myself that I would one day finish that with kids that I would eventually have that I now have, you know? So this is a cool project. We're gonna finish for one of them. And then that one, once they get old enough, we will all build it together. And I'll have one car each, one Integra each. Cause we all know, if you're a car guy, if you're a Honda guy, nothing beats the Integra. I don't care. I don't care what car comes out, what's new, what's old. I've had so many different cars in my life and I have dope collection right now, as you guys see. And I'm 33 years old and I just bought another Integra because it's literally my favorite car. It's my ultimate, like it make, brings tears to my, my eyes because I think about the days when I used to build the Hondas and do this out of my mom's garage, which is what built this whole business. And um, just doing this right now is just so surreal. Like it's crazy doing this right now. Let's see how this thing looks. Oh, wow. Damn, this brings me back to my, my teenage years, man. I regret selling my red Recaros. They're worth so much money now. But look at that. So much better. So much better. I'm gonna try to source out the, uh, the, red, the red carpet. But damn. Oh, yeah. That looks so good. 
All the cars are red and, red and black with the red interior. Way better. What do you guys think? The black DC5 Recaro's or the red DC2 Recaro's? Thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope this was an amazing vlog for you guys. It was our first one. Uh, so I hope you know you guys were engaged. If you guys are looking to see certain things, shoot us a comment in the, in the thing below and uh, make sure you like, subscribe. And I wanted to know if you guys like the black Recaro's or the red Recaro's. Let me know in the comments. Let's go baby.